So to start, let's let u equal the natural log of x. Then du equals 1 over x dx follows. And so the given integral is the same as the integral of the natural log of u divided by um, u. And this u is that ln of x right there. But we still need to write times 1 over x dx. Right? OK. And this x here is that x. And obviously, that dx is that dx. But then we see that 1 over x times dx is what we said was du right here. Right? OK. So uh, we see that we can write uh, this integral like this. Yeah? It is here that we see that we have to do substitution again. And this time, let's let t equal the natural log of u. And from here, uh, we see that uh, that's that, right? We see that uh, dt is going to equal 1 over u du, right? And so first, let's rewrite this integral here in a way that's going to make it easy to see what should follow. And that's uh, let's write it as the natural log of u times 1 over u du. That way, 1 over u du is simply dt. And uh, the natural log of u is just t. So our integral is now, our integral is now uh, the integral of simply uh, t times dt. OK, cool. We know how to do this. It's t squared divided by 2 plus c, right? OK. And uh, then we see that t is the natural log of u. So we can write our answer as the natural log of u squared divided by 2 plus c. But we started with an x and uh, um, the argument of the natural log. So we need to get back. And that just requires that we uh, claim this u to be the natural log of x, right? So finally, our final answer is going to be this here. Right? OK, cool. Keep watching. Take care.